NASA today also unveiling new technology aimed at promoting better accountability and safety within the police department. News Hall's Eileen LaPalmer got a closer look at its new police body cameras. Officer gets out, boom. It releases. This is the body camera chosen by Nassau County officials. It's been a selection process a year in the making. We're interested to see what's out there. What are the options? Last June, Nassau County Executive Laura Curran told us she had begun the search and now the county has selected a well qualified vendor based here on Long Island called Island Tech Services. Body cameras will be worn by uniformed police officers while they are on patrol. And we expect this to be fully implemented by the end of this year. There are 2,500 members of the Nassau Police Department and the county executive says right now the plan is to have each officer paid $3,000 to wear the body camera. In the past, the Nassau PBA opposed police body cameras and the stipend for the officers is part of the negotiations with the union. In a statement today, though, the president of the Nassau PBA said Nassau police officers do not oppose wearing the apparatus if this conclusion is reached through contractually obligated negotiations between the county and the Nassau County PBA. Why are we paying Nassau County police extra bonuses to wear these body cameras. Jeremy Joseph with Long Island United to transform policing and community safety says officers so should camera. not be receiving more taxpayer money to wear the cameras. That's a, a miscarriage of justice that it's make, you know, making accountability optional for police and paying them a bonus as if they are doing us a favor. The first officer expected to have the camera on their uniform in September. In Mineola, Eileen LaPalmer, News 12, Long Island. Well, the county estimates it will cost $5 million to purchase the 2,500 cameras and for video storage as well. It will cost an additional $7.5 million every year if each officer is paid the $3,000.